Hello iObserver fans! Today's video is all about how to cast iPad to TV so you can enjoy your favorite content on a bigger screen or show off how cool your vacation was to your family and friends. We have several methods to help complete the connection, so watch the whole video to catch them all. Before we give away all our secrets, give this video a like, subscribe to the iObserver channel, and ring that notification bell so you never miss another video. All right, so we know that different TVs have different capabilities, depending on who makes them and what software they decide to upload to them. Sometimes it's even less clear, with common brands playing all sides of the field and producing TV models with competing platforms. Take Chromecast, for example. Chromecast supports a handful of first-party applications like YouTube or Netflix by default. However, the funky technology differences between Apple and Google mean, outside of a few exceptions, casting from iPad to TV setups with Chromecast requires a third-party app, especially for personal content. Our first secret is the Docast app, but we don't expect you to keep it private. Docast is such a great app. You should tell all your Chromecast-owning family and friends how it basically replaces AirPlay. Using Docast is easy and connects your iPad to a Chromecast device in seconds. It's an excellent way to cast your photos, videos, or music playlists to share with unwilling family and friends. Download the app, allow it to connect to your Wi-Fi, and select your Chromecast, and voila, you're ready to go. Choose photos or videos, then select the video you want to cast. Docast will automatically start the casting process once you select your media. We love Docast because you get high-quality casting in a user-friendly package. We'll just leave a link in the comments, and you experience it for yourself. As an alternative to Chromecast, you may consider trying Roku or another platform that supports AirPlay directly. AirPlay is also available to anyone who sprung for the Apple TV, and both platforms offer a direct way for users to cast from iPad to TV without much effort. While you can stream apps like YouTube and Netflix, you can also cast and mirror by hopping into your control center, hitting the screen mirroring button, and then finding your TV. Either swipe from your upper right hand or from the bottom of your iPad screen to access the control center. Tap on the two rectangles overlapping. This is the screen mirroring button, and it launches the available TVs for you to broadcast to. Google and Apple-supported TVs make up a large portion of the available models, but a portion of the market has Amazon written all over it. And this is our next method. The Fire TV and Fire Stick lineup of smart TVs and devices offer yet another way for users to connect devices for casting content onto a TV. We can recommend Docast, described above, for use with Fire TV, and there's no need to install it on the TV. Simply open the app on the iPad, grant the necessary permissions, select your Fire TV from the list, and voila! You can stream media or mirror the iPad screen in a matter of seconds. Give it a try. The quality is no worse than streaming via AirPlay. Another hidden gem is the AirScreen app, which allows users to cast iPad to TV when it has the Fire TV software. Today, it provides millions of users the ability to cast content from an iPad to a Fire TV in a streamlined platform. Download AirScreen on the Fire TV and ensure your TV and iPad are on the same Wi-Fi network. On your iPad, access the control panel like you would for AirPlay. Tap on the screen mirroring button and select the device with AS in the name and you're ready to mirror your iPad. Despite the smart TV revolution, there are still models out in the wild that lack smart software and users need to get creative when attempting to connect an iPad. For these TVs, an old-fashioned adapter is the way to go. All you need is an HDMI cable and a lightning or USB-C to HDMI adapter, and you can connect your iPad for easy casting. The old-fashioned method works even when a connection isn't available, but forget about relaxing on the couch. Playing games, casting photos, or listening to your playlist will demand you stand a mere six feet from the TV, reducing your flexibility. We looked at a handful of ways that you can get content from your iPad onto TVs with solutions to help Google, Apple, and Amazon users. We even covered how to connect an iPad when all else fails. So, can an iPad cast a TV? Of course, and now you know our secrets for making it possible. Let us know in the comments section 
which method you found most useful and share this video with your friends and family so they know how to connect their iPads to a TV. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you in the next video.